Mega yachts are a common luxury for the wealthy, similar to private jets and grand mansions. These luxurious boats, staffed by professional crews, range from 79 feet to an impressive 500 feet in length. While many expensive yachts exist, we're highlighting the top five in this video. The demand for these high-end yachts has surged, especially in 2020, making it a booming year for both the wealthy and yacht manufacturers. Sam Tucker, head of super yacht research at Vessels Value, mentioned that it's tough to find a slot at a new build yard due to high demand. Essentially, 2020 was an excellent year for those in the mega yacht industry. Any wealthy yacht owner wants their vessel to reflect their status, right down to how they pronounce yacht. They add exotic features and designs to their yachts to make them stand out. In this video, we will showcase five people who have spent the most on their sea travels. But first, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss a video. Number five is the yacht Dubai, costing $400 million. This project started in 1995 with Blom plus Voss and Lursen, initially for Prince Jeffrey of Brunei. However, by 2001, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Dubai's ruler, completed it. From 2006 to 2009, it was the largest yacht at 530 feet long and 72 feet wide. Though other yachts have since surpassed it, Dubai still offers top-notch luxury with its eight decks, accommodating 88 crew members and 115 guests. Features include a 10-meter swimming pool, a squash court, a cinema, 20 water bikes, a disco, a lobster tank, and a dining room for 90 guests. It also has a helipad and two motorboats, with four powerful diesel engines propelling it at 26 knots for up to 8,500 nautical miles. Number four is A+, costing $527 million. The UAE leads the market in owning mega yachts and Mansour bin Zayed Al Nayyan, worth $22 billion and owner of Manchester City Soccer Club, owns A+. This 482-foot yacht with a 70-foot beam can move swiftly at 22.9 knots, thanks to its twin engines generating 7,990 horsepower each. Launched in 2012, it's the ninth largest yacht globally. It boasts eight decks, a swimming platform, two helipads, a jacuzzi, a fitness hall, a conference room, a cinema, and underwater lights. The crew ensures top-notch service and luxury. Number three is Azam. Priced at $605 million, owned by Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayyan, Sheikh Mansour's half-brother and head of the Abu Dhabi ruling family. Azam, launched by Lursen in 2013, is the largest private yacht at 590 feet long and 95 feet wide. Despite its size, it can reach 32 knots with engines generating 47,000 horsepower. It accommodates 60 crew members and 35 passengers in luxury, featuring a 50-meter long foreship with a helipad. Its interior design by Christophe Leone reflects royalty, and it took just three years to build. Number two is Eclipse, valued at $1.5 billion. Built by Blom Plus Voss, a subsidiary of Lursen, and launched in 2010, this 533-foot yacht was the longest until Azam. With 40,000 horsepower engines, it travels at 22 knots. It features a missile detection system and a submarine that goes 50 meters deep, along with an anti-paparazzi system that prevents unwanted photos. Eclipse offers 24 guest cabins, two large pools, hot tubs, a disco hall, and two helipads. Owned by Russian-Israeli billionaire Roman Abramovich, who also owns Chelsea Football Club, it's a symbol of luxury and security. Number one is History Supreme, costing $4.8 billion. Though the smallest on the list, it stands out with its gold and platinum covering. Designed by Stuart Hughes in 2011, it's rumored to be owned by Malaysian billionaire Robert Kwok. The yacht includes a master suite with a wall of meteoric stone and a sculpture made from T-Rex dinosaur bones. These yachts may seem extravagant, but they also create jobs. Peter Lursen, CEO of Lursen, notes that building Azam involved 6 million hours of work, supporting over 4,000 families. Maintaining these yachts also generates numerous jobs. What do you think of these top five mega yachts? Which one is your favorite? If you had $10 billion, would you buy a yacht or spend it differently? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and see you next time.